Samsung's weird ass robots have made a return this year and that's ultimately what I love about CES, the consumer electronics show that kickstarts every year and promises to bring with it the latest and greatest technology the world has ever seen and some wild and wacky inventions that also never see the light of day. So today we're going to jump into Next Generation Robotics by Samsung, where they have come up with a domestic robot to help pour your wine and do the dishes in amongst other things. Let's get into it. All right, so the first video we're gonna watch is Next Generation Robotics by Samsung. I'm gonna kick it off. I'll run some commentary as we go through. Robotics very Korean home, high-end. You've seen Parasite or lived in AI Korea like me. You'll know what I'm talking about. Create solutions that both care very well-dressed Korean man, and isn't help he? You along so the way. handsome. Whether you're at home or outside of it, you, are this at looks the like set design. Of all our Could even be a virtual set, to be honest. Now, we're going to show you what this looks Nothing like. Looks fairly consistent. In a not too distant future. First, definitely a set. All Samsung shot within a studio. Samsung Botcare uses AI technology safe. to take care of Samsung all the little Botcare. details in your life. Getting some Wally vibes by here. By recognizing and understanding your oh, behaviors. Oh yes, it's a portable a robotic assistant, laser scanner, and a companion. <laughs> You've been on your computer too long. How about stretching and taking a short break? Yeah, I'm just so relaxed with my robot in my house, just making my life so the much conference call easier. Is scheduled in a few minutes. Oh yes, it's got an iPad built into the top. knows your schedule tab, and your habits, and can remind you of Very the conference handy. call you have with colleagues. Coming up in 15 yep. minutes. Takes all the hassle around. Now out remember of the box you saw in our studio. Your iPad earlier. in the right way. That was bought. So you can get handy. that optical viewing. Lens. A home robot that can both recognize and grab objects, becoming an extension of you, in the kitchen, in the living room, and That's anywhere nice, else nice you may need that extra hand in your home. Bot handy. Let's show them what you've got. The bot handy. Look at this. Bot it's handy an air conditioner with an arm. To understand objects. Or like can analyze cup, dishes that are dirty. Pick them up with utmost precision and taking care. Taking note of their shape and materials to work. That's fucking awesome. Your trusted partner. <laughs> Give me that now. Bot handy oh, can move around. Adjust the height. Put your clothes away. Like set the table. This is what the future of robotics is all about. Pour your wine. It flips the script. On what a robot in your home. I mean that ball like. thing from last year. I Good mean, job. This is this has really come a long way. Oh. Wait, I don't know about that first robot. That seems like a bit of a waste of time. But the Samsung Bot Care to do your dishes, put your things away, and pour you a glass of wine. Now that's an invention I can get behind. How cool is that? I love Samsung. They're not always the best products, but they're always first in market. And that's a very intentional part of their strategy and how they do things. And they really kind of pride themselves on being first, first to innovate, first to put things out. That means they would make a lot of mistakes and look at kind of the Galaxy Fold, some of the early um, smartwatches from, Galaxy smartwatches from Samsung as well. It took a few iterations for them to really kind of get those products to work, but they, they get there in the end, they always do. And they do it in a faster way because they use the live audience, the kind of early adopters to kind of help refine and craft those products in real time in the real world with real users. So it's a smart strategy. It's a very Korean strategy, um, one that I'm very familiar with. I actually worked on Samsung for a number of years, uh, living in South Korea across a range of different briefs. So I really know that company well. I know how they kind of design products and how they think about putting them into market and communicating them. And these are just some other great examples. So. Um, that's our Samsung video. That's robotics of the future. Um, I don't think these are gimmicks. I think they're probably not going to be great. They're probably going to have a bunch of bugs in their first iteration. But over time, they've, they've got something here in the Bot Care robot, something that I think we probably will see in our homes one day in the near future. And yeah, it's really that next step um, beyond kind of your, your smart home assistants like Alexa and, and Google Home and Siri. And I think actually kind of having 
a physical interface to actually do things that are useful and practical around the house. Feels like a logical next step. This has been JP uh, on the Walron channel. If you like this video, smash, hit, whatever, punch, click the like and subscribe button. That'll make the YouTube algorithm do its thing and get this video in front of more people, which means we can make more videos like this. Peace and love to you all.